Fall in the low country is a great time of the year. The water temperatures are cooling, the creeks are full of bait, and the wildlife is abundant, which makes the ride a very memorable trip. You always seem to see something a little different from the last trip. The air has a crisp bite to it and just a, a smell that defines autumn. As you wind your way through the curves and bends of the creeks, you notice a change in the Spartina grass. Green a week ago, and now the tips are turning their golden autumn brown. The fish are starting to feed and eat as much as possible to prepare for our long low country winters. Popping court rigs are a popular choice among creek fishermen and paired with a live shrimp or mudman, they can produce great numbers of spot tail bass. One thing about the shrimp, it's not only the favorite meal of ours, but just about everything else that swims. So you may have to deal with quite a few of the unpopular sea creatures while you're waiting for that unmistakable cork disappearing act of the spot tail bass. When you're fishing for spot tail, the use of a circle hook seems to work oh, well yeah, for me under popping corks. Calm down. Yeah, we got you. I'm gonna let you go. Come on over here. The bass don't play around when they eat. When they inhale their meal, the circle hook is a smart choice, especially when you're fishing with your kids. The circle will find its way to the corner of the mouth just about every time. Man, have you ever done this before? You sure? Oh, he's got injuries too. Little bottle. And we're going to take a, a, a <laughs> tablespoon of honey. I didn't know that's a tablespoon. It's just a guess. It looks like one uh, to me. Okay, How about okay. you? This is it. This is the magic sauce. Soy sauce. Uh. Now the biggest <laughs> thing is you're going to have to incorporate the honey into the soy sauce operation. <laughs> so that right there, we can let it sit for a few minutes. Mm -hmm. Let all the flavors work together. And then we're ready to uh, marinate fish. Now we're gonna take the magic blackening rub. Why well, is this magic? It's because I made it. Oh, okay. It's got some voodoo in it. Okay, okay. What we do is we just, I like to uh, kind of push it down into the meat, get it stuck down in there. All right, here we go. Oh, yes. It's gonna be a very quick cook. In about a minute, minute and a half on each side, and we're basically transfer it into the oven to finish the cooking process off. Okay, now we're gonna take our red wine butter sauce, make a little pool 
for everything. Purple mashed potatoes. Man. A little uh, herb potato crisp and add just a little bit of uh, excitement there for you. There you go. Black and red fish, purple mashed potatoes, served with julienne vegetables all over a red wine butter sauce. Hey, it's David Murray. Hope you enjoyed my short little film. And don't forget to make memories that last a lifetime. Take your kids fishing. Hope to see you on the water.